Magistrate Xanthi told me that you've been having trouble with your farm. Crop failure. It's as if Ares herself salted the earth. How are the crops failing? Blight. Few plants grow, and the ones that do are wilted and covered in spots. The gods would never let this happen if they were happy. It's my godless Elotes, I tell you. You're a messenger of Zeus. You show them the light. I'll find out what's happening. Oh, thank Zeus. My Elotes, Tefta and Maron. They work the fields, but they do not respect the gods. Teach them. I haven't seen other farms in the area with blighted crops. What could be causing the difference? The grain grew in short and dry. Then the animals started to grow ill. Obvious signs of displeasing Persephone or her mother. Maron claims the animals have been poisoned, but I have no enemies to speak of. What makes you blame your Ilotes for the blight? Have they tampered with the plants and animals? They do not worship as you and I do. I thank Dimitir for all she gives us at the end of each day. But they just reap the bounty of her hard work. So... it's divine intervention? What else dictates our fates? Oh, Tefta won't stop babbling about the soil. Thinks I overwork my farm. Idiot woman. As if this farm hasn't been in my family for generations. I'll go talk with your Ilotes and see what they know. Mistios. Here. Your master claims this blight is the will of the gods. What do you think? Sometimes crops fail. Could be dry soil, could be insects. It's a shame about the donkey. He was more crucial to the farm's success than the master. Or you, for that matter. How can I make clearing the ground easier? The hoe I'm using is falling apart. I have to fix the blade every few swings. Something more sturdy would make it go faster. It's not like you're shackled to this patch of land. What's preventing you from getting a new hoe? Have you ever been beaten so hard you lose hearing in one of your ears? That's what happened last time I went to market without permission. Oh, of course. I'll look for one. Here you go. This should make digging easier. You're all right for a stranger. Look, the water's tasted like a rusty blade for the past few weeks. Last time I had water like that was when I was downriver from a blacksmith. Thank you. Journey across the sticks be a more peaceful end than this. Debris might be getting stuck in this net. Maybe the dead man was a fisherman. Huh. These don't look like the knife wounds of a man. I'll bet it's the metal from the armor giving the water a bad taste. Man is going to linger on me. At least the river runs clear now.
You there? Could you help an ailing woman by getting some mint? I picked some up on my way. The back patch of land is riddled with blight like I've only seen once before. My old master lost his whole farm to it. I'll never forget the smell. The back of the farm? I'll take a look. I wonder anything grows in this field with all this mess crushing the plants. The tanners in Kefalonia use something that smells awful to make leather. It can't be good for the soil. The earth is stained here. That can't be good for the soil. It seems like fire is the only way to make sure of ending this blight. I have to tidy everything up around here. Now I'm beginning to understand Tefta's anger. The diseased crops have been burned, and the river is cleared. That should be the last of the blight. Oh, you truly are God sent. What was the cause of the rot? You were so busy looking to the sky that you ignored what was in front of you. The gods are not responsible for cleaning the fields or the river. That's on you. What? You dare? Xanthi said you are an agent of Zeus, but you are a false champion as godless as my Ilotes. Get out from here! The poison in your fields is nothing compared to the poison in your heart. <laughs> 